Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise Ahaya, everybody. Praise Ahaya. One more time. Praise Ahaya from whom all blessings flow. Amen and amen. This is your sister Carrie Ann and Yesiah the Christ. Yesiah the Messiah. <coughs> Yesiah of Nazareth. If you want to know why, I call God Ahaya. And the biblical Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Yesiah. I've done a video concerning that one. Greetings. Greetings to the 12th scattered tribe of Yashahel. Yashahel is the name given to Jacob. Jacob's name was not changed to Israel. The proper name is Yashahel. So I greet all the Hebrew Yashahelites scattered to the four corners of the earth, all over in the diaspora. I greet you all in the precious, glorious name of our soon coming King, Yesiah the Christ. And to the body of Christ of the church. Hallelujah. Whom oh, most dies coming back far without spot, wrinkle, or blemish. I greet you all in your precious, glorious name of our soon coming King, Messiah the Christ. All right. You can skip this bit. <coughs> okay. You can skip this bit. And um, sorry, brothers and sisters. I just made a video that was a nearly 40 minutes long. So I'm doing a second one. My throat gets dry. Um, <coughs> sorry. Um, you can skip this bit and find the main message, all right? I'm going to do some housekeeping. Remember my name, Sister Carrie Ann. It is in solid gray border with a little tick by the side. Anybody else in the comment section pretending to be me is a wicked, dirty devil. You need to rebuke and report them. Please watch the video to the end. There's a sinner's prayer there for you. And also we do something called the top 20. Any beautiful beloved in the most hiya uh, that comment on any video, and once you're in the top 20, it's more than 20, really. But once you're in the top 20, I give your name a little shout out. Amen. All right. Um, thank you very much for liking the videos. Thank you for sharing them. Thank you for using the comment section. Oh, it really, I really appreciate it, brothers and sisters, because it just helps with the algorithm on this platform. It really, really does. So I appreciate that. If you have not, if you, yeah, if you're not accepted Yesaya, you need to do. But if you're not yet um subscribe to the channel please do by hitting the bell notification button all right um and thank you for those of you who have blessed me through paypal i really really appreciate it is it has been my bread and butter hallelujah all right okay we have um our prophetic our prophetic theme banner is called we are near we're not only near to the return of the beautiful sweet savior Messiah the christ but also to the revealing of the lawless one Mm -hmm. the anti-messiah the antichrist <laughs> we are near to that one coming on the scene listen brothers and sisters the lawlessness is coming daniel 7 verse 25 tells you satan is going to change times laws and season the world will look like mad max aka mel gibson type movie and the book of eli that type of post-apocalyptic, wicked, dirty world. You want to make sure that you're anchor holes in Christ. You want to make sure that you're found worthy. Worthy to escape these things coming up on the earth. Because when Ahia says to be found worthy, he is not talking about the sixth seal opening up. Something is going to happen that... You will need to be worthy for the Lord to bring you to a place of safety, to, for, for, for him to cause you to escape the chaos that's coming. Woman in Revelation 12. Hallelujah. 12 stars represent the 12 Hebrew tribes all over the world in 2022. Great, grand, global, second, worldwide exodus is going to happen that is what ahaya is saying you need to be found worthy to go in that second exodus with the hebrew yashahelites that's going to exit out of babylon because we're going back to where it all begins amen um so make sure you're found worthy all right brothers and sisters or a prophetic theme song called we are near it's a song that my mommy taught me when i was a little girl and the song goes like this Oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now, hallelujah. Yes, we are near. We can sing that song with right confidence. Just hold on, brothers and sisters. Amen. We can sing that song with right confidence. Remember, I have two ministries, isn't it? 
end time prophetic ministry where I talk about everything end time antichrist lawlessness yeah tsunamis earthquakes mark of the beast crushing the economy and the second ministry is to and for the Hebrew yes I like the 12 scatter tribe all over the world in 2022 so we're going to talk about um end times all right now <clears throat> I did a video about Chris Brown, isn't it? I think it's this year. Time flies, isn't it? I did a video, a very powerful vision the Lord gave me about this young man. And I said that Ahaya has got his hands on him. Yes, he's wicked at the moment. But, you know, Yesaya, don't under, underestimate the power of Ahaya. Don't underestimate the power of Yesaya. Don't underestimate the power of the Holy Spirit, all right? Um, and in this video, in this vision that I did, I saw Chris Brown and his mom. His mom showed up in the vision, but he was singing and he was singing gospel, and his voice was just immaculate, crisp, clean, holy. This is in the realm of the spirit in the vision. And I forgot what I said. I said some stuff to him. I leave the vision pin, I can't remember it totally, but I know he was singing for the most high. All right. But I'll try and find a vision and I leave it pain and you need to watch it. A lot of people like Chris Brown. Christians. Bad, good, ugly, wicked, everybody. A lot of people like that guy. The Lord impressed something in my spirit yesterday. The 23rd of November. 2022 concerning Chris Brown what I saw in my spirit it is not good it's not good brothers and sisters I believe that what the Lord was showing me is that the elites right they want to take him out it's time that's what I heard it's time so you know what these dirty people how they do their sacrifices when they when they finish with you they kill you off <clears throat> that's what they do when they finish with you they kill you off isn't it physically this one is physical this is not a destruction of his career or, you know he and he ends up on drugs or on the street no this is a this is a physical death this is six feet under the earth that i saw So, he's not safe. Brownie, I call him Brownie. Brownie, <laughs> Chris Brown. He ain't, he's not safe. The planning for him, brothers and sisters, what I saw him, it just came up in my spirit. I wasn't thinking about him. I wasn't, I don't even listen to his wicked music. Whew, never. I used to when I was wicked. But, uh, don't ask me songs because I don't know them. I have no idea, right? But I saw in the room of the spirit, um, that they want to take him out for whatever reason I don't know I don't fully I kind of <clears throat> I kind of understand the reason and it's really deep I'm not even going to explain it because people are going to think oh and, but in my spirit the reasons were coming to me and it's deep very deep but we don't want another situation like Alia. Let me repeat that one more time. We do not want another situation like the singer Alia who died in a plane crash. We don't want that. Though the hands of the most dies on his life, and I truly believe. And you know, some of you are going to come at me as sister carry soul is soul to Satan. <laughs> He's in the Illuminati, is Chris Brown. He's of the devil. I know everybody who's a sinner is of the devil. Understand that. Everybody, whether you're in the Illuminati or not, you are of Satan. Because you do not know Yesiah. All right? You're not a born again child of the Most High. All right? So, what I saw, like I say, they want to take him out. It's, it's time. That's what I heard in my spirit. It's time. So whether or not his time is up, 
But at the end of the day, Ahaya has got the last say. I believe that for Chris Brown to be truly protected and to have a life worth living to and for Ahaya, to and for Yesaya, to and for the Holy Spirit, he has to, he must give his heart to the Lord before it's too late. He's, he's got to, but what I'm saying, he's got to repent. Chris Brown has got to repent. Like literally, rather sooner than later. Because it's not in the spirit, it's in the spirit, he's not looking pretty for him. A lot of things, I don't know. It's not looking pretty. But what I would say to Chris Brown is this, you need to link up with Ye, Black Moses. You need to link up with Black Moses, yeah. Repentance is the order of the day. For him to be safe, I know you're going to say, some people, well, we just pray and ask Ahaya for covering and protection. That's fine, but when you're continuing to do wickedly, and you're continuing to live a life that's displeasing to the Most High, how is he going to protect you? His grace and mercy is only extended for, for a period of time. And if he chooses not to extend his grace and mercy on your life, then that is it. But you want to be in a place where his grace and his mercy is continually extending to you. Chris Brown must repent. Like this is a, I don't even know how this message is going to get to this brother. Honestly, I have no idea. I'll try to look him up. But there's so many fake profiles. I don't even know who is, who brothers and sisters. People say, oh, Sister Kara, go on Instagram. So like I went on Instagram to type in, um, I did a video concerning Andrew Tate. And there's so many, of, I don't know, there's so many Andrew Tates with his profile coming up. Are you? So I don't know, brothers and sisters. I don't follow these people, you see. So those of you who follow Chris Brown, who you can DM him and whatever you, if you want to send me his proper, true email or his IG account or whatever, then send it to me. I'll, I'm happy to, to click on the link and, and post the video. But you can also post it because his life is in danger. That's what I'm trying to say. His life is in, his life is in danger. And if I see him in front of me right now, I will tell him the truth. It is scary because you don't want to, you don't want anybody to say to you, oh, well, you know, Timmy, your life is in danger. It's, it's not a nice place to be, but the truth is the truth. I've done that video. I saw him singing for Hahaya, but he just won't come to Christ. I don't know. He just loves this, the dirty world. He just loves the world and he needs to give it up. Because if he don't give it up, I am telling you, we don't want another Aliyah. Like, literally. We don't, we just don't want another one. All right, we just don't. I'm losing my voice. So, I pray. I'm going to pray for him at the end of this video. I will. I'll pray for him. I don't know if I did pray for him in the last video. I can't, I can't remember if I prayed for Chris. But I'm going to pray for Chris Brown. Because I know that the hands of Ahaya is on his life. There's no if, buts, or maybe, but time is running out for him. Time is running out for Chris Brown. He needs to come over to Christ, really and truly. Like, please share this video with him. And let me just say, I don't, maybe he's not even going to see it because so many whatever, whatever, videos and videos. But listen, Chris Brownie, <laughs> all right? You really need to give your heart to Christ. And I know that Ahaya has been tugging at your heart for a very long time. But you just won't let go of the things of the world. All of these things will pass. Like literally, it will go away. It will vanish. But what lasts forever is your soul. That is what lasts forever. And Yesaya, hallelujah the Christ, but some people call him Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I call him Yesiah. Yesiah wants to 
clean you up, make you into a vessel. He wants to fill your cup, not just fill it, but run it over. He wants you to be an oracle for him through your music. Now, I used to listen to you, Brownie. Yeah, I used to listen to you. And um, listen, when you do wicked music, ungodly music, you take the people to a place where their mind must not go there. They begin to sexualize. They begin to fantasize. They begin to do this. It is wicked. This is what you're doing, leading many, 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 many people away from Christ. That in their that in their daily life, all they can think about is ungodly stuff because they're listening to your music. Because that is where your music takes them. Your music don't take them to a place where they can say, "All right, yes." Ahaya has been good to me today. He's been no, no. You're building the kingdom of darkness, and it hurts the most. I you have to repent. He's extending his hands to you. He wants you. You are a soldier for him. But if you do not accept the calling, then it's not going to be pretty. You have nothing to fear. I don't care what contract you've signed. I've, that that does not bother the most that when he's going to bring you out of darkness. Contract, whatever, whatever. Sign to Satan, bloom, illumina. Yeah, them, those things. You just have to be fearless. That's why I say you need to link up. And I'm really serious. You must link up with Kanye. You must link up with Ye. That is what the message in my spirit. You have to link up with him. See, the problem is that a lot of people think oh, Ye is a madman, you know, whatever. But he's going to bring a lot of these people in the wicked music industry to Christ. He, will, he really will. Repent, please. I'm going to pray for you. But you have to repent. I have to call out to the most that you got to change your lifestyle. You got to represent the most I. It is not too late, like I say. We don't want another Alea. <laughs> we just we don't want, we don't want another Alea. To gain this world and to lose your soul is it's not it's not yeah. So we'll leave the, the powerful vision that I had a couple months ago in the um, description box. All right. You can watch it as well. But let me just pray. Right. I feel so heavy hearted in my spirit. Honestly, like really, really. We have to pray for mercy, isn't it? For Chris Brown. I know he's wicked. Eh? I know he's a sin and everything like that. But we just get, we only can ask a higher for mercy and ask him to extend his hand upon this young man. That he will change, he will, he, a higher will deliver him and set him free. Hallelujah to your name, Lord. Hallelujah to the Lamb that was slain before the foundation of the earth. We give you honor, we give you glory, and we give you praise. We lift you up, we magnify you. There is none like you, O oh, Ahaya. And for that reason, you deserve all the honor, all the glory that is due unto your name. Hallelujah. Father, I come before you with a humble heart. I, I'm coming before you, beseeching on Chris Brown's behalf. Not me alone, but all the body of Christ that's watching this channel and agree with this prayer. Lord, we're asking you to save Chris Brown. Father, bring him to a place where he will repent of his wicked ways, where he will repent of of his sins and turn his life over to you before it's too late father I've done the video you've shown me in the realm of the spirit what the wicked is planning for this young man oh these people are just i don't even know what to call them Those words just fail me these elites wicked dirty devils heavenly father but lord we're asking you for sweet mercy upon his life we're asking you to extend mercy unto Chris Brown. I pray, Lord, in the extending of your mercy. Father, please meet him. 
Hallelujah. Meet him, Father. Arrest his spirit. Hallelujah. Arrest his spirit, Heavenly Father. Let him surrender all to you, all to Yesiah. Let him say all to Yesiah. Hallelujah. I surrender all to him. I freely give. Glory be to the Most High. Father, please, we're begging you. I can see the danger surrounding this young man. Yes, Lord, we don't want anything to happen to Chris Brown. It's the truth. We don't. We don't want another Aliyah. We don't want it, Heavenly Father. So, Lord, we're coming against these plans of Satan, these plans of the enemy. But at the same time, Chris Brown needs to come to you before it's too late. Please, Heavenly Father, visit him. Send somebody to minister to him. Show him a sign or something, Lord. Whatever way you choose fit. But I know, Lord, that you've been tugging at his heart for a long time. You've been tugging at this young man's heart for a long time, but he just won't repent. <laughs> Father, please have mercy. Hallelujah to the Lamb that was slain before the foundation of the earth. Hallelujah. Father, have mercy. All we can pray and beg and ask, because everything is in your hands. Have mercy. I feel, I don't know, Father, in my spirit with this prayer, I feel that there's some mercy that's been extended to him. Hallelujah. And I pray that in that window of mercy, please, Ahaya, please let him come to you. Lord, Ahaya, let him sing for you. You showed me the vision. I saw him in the realm of the spirit. His voice was just immaculate. Angelic when he was singing for you. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb. Please, Ahaya, have mercy. He's a, he is one of your son, but a stubborn one. <laughs> that needs to repent. Amen. Hallelujah. So, Father, we thank you. We glorify you and we honor you. We lift you up and we bless your holy name. And all these things we look to you by faith in Yesiah holy glorious name amen and amen amen hallelujah hallelujah to pray for him my spirit is heavy really and truly concerning christ but you know we're praying we trust in the lord i feel that this prayer there's extended mercy upon his life extended mercy but i don't know i shouldn't say i don't know i just not i just don't want to say it all right i kind of know why i don't want to do certain things with this young man. Because they're upset. Trust me. <laughs> it's deeper than what you think. They're very, very upset, these people. Very, very. They're upset with the, with the, listen. They're upset with the Kyrie Aaron, a.k.a. Aaron. They're upset with Black Moses, a.k.a. Ye. They're upset with the, um, the movie, Hebrews to Negroes. It's a lot of, it's, listen, you might look and say, oh no, trust me, trust me, brothers and sisters, this is deeper than what you think. Ahaya is able, amen, he is able, glory be to the most high. All right, if we come to the end of the video, these are the top 20 beautiful beloved and the powerful video that I did concerning football. Ooh, footy, good old footy. And you know, some people in the comment section were basically outright telling me, Sister Carrie and football is of the devil. They're not having it. <laughs> Though I explained to them what makes football demonic, they're just not listening. They just said, ah, oh, the whole thing is of Satan. That's just what they say, but it's not true. Kicking a ball is not of the devil. Really and truly, it's, it's not. If you're going to say football is of Satan, then you need to say all sport is of Satan. So that means if you put it on weight or if the doctor advises you, you need to do a bit of exercising. Don't go to the gym. Don't lift any weights. Don't lift any weights because we have sports that do the weight lifting. Don't be running on the treadmill because you got sports that do athletics. Don't be doing... um. And your crunches with your tummy up and down, getting your crunches, getting your abs. Don't bother to do that because you got both that rose. So you have to use wisdom. Not everything is demonic. Football in itself is not demonic. The sport is the people. You have some people who are mix up, mix up, mix up. 
so you have to take it individually all right yeah you have to take it in my son played a little football today he did they had uh, um a little tournament called world cup he played against a different school and he scored a hat trick am i gonna run and say oh that was you shouldn't have done that as of the devil is that football no <laughs> no no you know he scored his little three little goals put it in the back of the net he won he were pretending his team was spain so there were you had uh, what did they have you have netherlands spain brazil germany and somebody else five five of them you had and um out of the five that to do little tournaments beat each other and his team spain won with him scoring an hat trick so you know it's what are you gonna say to the children Kid, football is football brothers it's the adults that make it wicked it's not the game it's not a literal sport like i said kicking the ball put it in the back of the net i'm gonna do call the top 20 in a minute but listen quickly right you go to church your pastor said all right we're gonna do a bit of football outside five brother want one five aside so ten brothers in the church everybody get excited you know these are all christian men they're not sinners the men of the most high all right so the outside playing a little football kicking the ball so you're going to look at them and say that they're demonic are you going to look at the football game and say, oh, it's of the devil? How are they sinning? Bible said that he that make it a lie will be thrown into the lake of fire. Be very careful. Be very, like what Sister Lily, Sister Lily, Prophetess Lily, be very careful. Be very careful. <laughs> I love you, Sister Lily. <laughs> be very, yeah, but it's serious. No, be very careful. Be very careful, all right? But anyways, so that's that's football. So these are the top 20 underneath the video that I did concerning football, all right? Um, let me get it, let me get it, let me get it. All right, so here we go. Michi, Mich bless. Conroy Jones, user HW5JX. Ingrid, am I, I think I've said this already. Ingrid Senior. No, I'm sorry, I've been there. Ingrid Senior. Hallelujah. No. Okay. Ingrid Senior. Apple of his eyes. Lane McLam. Juleth Bailey. He kept me. Jan Natural. Renita Miller. Audi Wheeler. Janice Hill, Shel Sh um, Shandell, daughter of the Most High, Peter, Todd, may love Jesus, the Carnival, baby, Shakira, Henry, Ernest, Carter, G R, Sherry. Anderson, Marquetta, Reed, Antoinette, Gorman, Kainsua, All Things Made New, Yaz Daughter, Paulette, Allen, Pauline Anderson, Renovate, DMV. All right, so those are the top 20 beautiful, beloved, and the powerful video that I did concerning footy. All right, brothers and sisters, um, if you come to the end of the video, you have not accepted Yesiah as Lord and Savior, uh, please say the sinner's prayer after me. Hallelujah. Dear Yesiah the Christ, I know that you are the son of Ahiah. I know that you are the son of Ahiah whom the world calls God. I believe, <coughs> I believe that Yesiah have died on the cross for my sins. Messiah, I thank you for dying for me. And I believe in your death, burial, resurrection, and that higher has raised you from the dead. Uh, raised you from the dead. I know with confidence that you are the son of a higher Messiah, king of glory. I come before you right now and I'm asking you to wash away all my sins and to forgive me for all that I've done wrong. I repent from my wicked ways, a higher. I thank you for your beautiful son, Messiah. And I pray that you will help me to live a life of repentance. 
and give up the things that's pleasing to you in this world. Thank you for salvation and for saving me. If you said that prayer, you can believe it with your heart. Well, come to the body of Christ. We believe in Acts 2, verse 38. talks about repentance. You've done the repenting part. You now need to find a man of the most that higher asking to fully baptize in water. When you go down in water, you're saying that you say died on the cross. You believe in the torment of sin. When the man of the most that raised you out of the water, you're risen to new life. You're risen to the glory and the power of Christ's resurrection beautiful stuff so be bold be strong be courageous walk with a higher just like Enoch all praises all beautiful praises to the most uh, higher who lives above the heavens a higher eternally bless you I love you all and I will see you soon someday in glory in Yesaya's holy name amen and amen let's say the benediction benediction is Jude chapter 1 Jude chapter 1 verses 24 to 25 the Bible reads not unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to oh, the only wise Yesaya or Savior be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen and amen. Amen. Blessings. Amen.